TV. My name is John and this is my co-presenter, Rati. Tonight's topic is, if you had a one wish, what would it be? Many people from different walks of life go about in life wishing things will just happen easily or just happen without any effort or work. Well, the truth is, things don't just happen. You need to work for them, especially young people. Guys, we have to face life. Face truth and face reality. So Isaac Newton's law says, for every action, there is a reaction. So, if you just sit down and expect things to happen, just by <laughs> a wish, you will be disappointed all the time. But if you want something to happen, look at the possibilities and work on it. And if, <laughs> and you will get what you want or what you wish for. <coughs> Let's take it to the field and hear what other people have to say about this question. If you had a wish, what would that be? I'd wish for more wishes. Thank you, so that I can keep on wishing. Yeah, I'd wish for more that wishes. That way I would have unlimited wishes. Thank you, precisely. Yeah. You see, that way I'll, you. I'll have everything I need. Exactly. Yeah. Next question. If you had one wish, what would it be? One wish. All experiences by trip around the world. Awesome. With a specific person. Thank you. If you had one wish, what would it be? I would um, go to the Lipopo River. And do what then? Um, canoe. And we're back. Let's take scripture into consideration. Proverbs 23 verse 7 says, As a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. Proverbs 21 verse 5 says, The plans of a hard-working people earn a profit. Those who work quickly become poor. Some people wish for peace, health, a better spouse, a better family. Some wish their family's members will still be alive. To be young or older, freedom, much more things that are not in their power to change. Beyond all this, look at your motive. Whatever motives you have to wish, all this must be realistic. Whatever you meditate on over and over will eventually materialize. Our thoughts become our actions depending on how much we desire to fulfill them. And this is through the choices we make. In conclusion, nothing in life is for free, so don't expect things to happen just by a wish. Sometimes you have to work hard to get your wishes, and sometimes you have to even ask to be given our wish. There is, there is a loving God above life on earth who is able to meet your needs and to make your life worth living if you are willing to allow Him to just care for you and take all your worries away. Don't compare yourself to other people. Realize that you are unique. Be yourself. Live a life that matters. Walk in your own path. Make your life count. And you will soon realize that some of the things you wish for, you don't even need. Oh, your background, your past, failures and disappointments are all behind you. Stop wishing that they were different and move on. Embrace your now and plan for tomorrow and you will have less regret. There are a lot of things we aren't and there are a lot of people we aren't. Be at peace with who you are, what you have and where you are. If you are not happy with who you are, change it. Things don't come easy, but things can happen when we are willing to change them. Well, that's all we have time for tonight on Type TV. May God bless you truly, through and through, in Jesus' name. Cause you're the only one I need I turn to 